would it be like? All right, look, I'm not going to do this every day. I've already said this, but I want to get some things started. And so since I want to get them started, I want to show me doing that. And so here we are with day three and also episode three of the self S E L F experiment. So, well, today, basically, we're going to look at climate. We're going to look at snowbank, look at what we put in that liquidity pool on Uniswap. Then we're also going to um, set up Wonderland Time on Avalanche, which is also a, a DAO program. And we're going to talk a little bit about Shiba Swap. But we're going to do this super quick. I feel like I don't want to go too long. So let's go get into it quickly. Let's go with Klima. So Klima, where are we at today? Make sure this is up to date. All right. So yesterday we ended off on a day of 5.519.99. And now we're at 0.5311. Okay. 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 I think the climb is down today, but like I said, we're not worried about that. We are more concerned with having more climber daily. Yeah, the climate dropped a lot, but the market went down a lot. So it is fitting more. You can see there more um, carbon has been sucked into the, the protocol. There's a new program I'm going to check a look at that's supposed to be doing this with ocean uh, conservation called DIAM, D-I-A-T-O-M, um, DAO. So take a look at that. Suppose it's super early. You can still get on the white list with that. So it's our climber. Now we're going to switch over to Avalanche. And go here to Snowbank and see where it is at reset everything just make sure apr you see now is down into the millions okay okay reasonable now wow almost a hundred a hundred million in terms of total volume under market cap 261 we are and i think this price has gone up today if i'm not mistaken uh let's see where we at with our stake for Snow load blank. We are at, we were at 0 0.008771 yesterday, and now we're at 0 0.009184. Okay. Moving up with that. Uniswap. Let's check our liquidity pool. Oh, I figured out what it was with the, um, Arbitrum, I was tripping. I'll just show you that really quickly. Just so you know, not as dumb and ugly as I look. So what you just have to, to do actually is that <clears throat> yesterday I didn't set any of this here. And so you have to set this stuff here. Um, I'm just picking some random numbers. But even still with this, it was still giving me a hard time with... Um, so we're on Arbitrum, Arbitrum, Arbitrum. Uh, preview. It was not letting me buy liquidity. Let's go with five. It still would go here. And then just do this over and over. So even though I was able to get to this part, it was just doing this. All right, so it's still doing that. Tripping off that, I ain't tripping. I'm getting sick of she would just be begging for you to be. It just begs for you to. Ah, uh, dang, relax, Pepin. Let's go back and look at our pool. So we have our pool we put in yesterday, barely any money. You see, we have, uh, <laughs> we've gotten, we we've received nothing so far. Liquidity is twelve dollars, but remember, we're just doing this on optimistic. And try to do an um, Arbitrum as well just to use those resources so that we were able to um, possibly get um, some token drops 
airdrops if um optimistic and arbitrum and hop and zk sync decide to have an airdrop we have you we were using those services during a period when they were beta testing so helping out with their beta testing uh i may jump in hop later and just switch and stuff back and forth but let's get into what we're going to do today so wonderland time is very similar to olympus dow it's a fork olympus dow on um avalanche from ethereum so it and it's um part of an ecosystem with abracadabra and popsicle pop abracadabra money i believe and popsicle finance which we're going to go down that rabbit hole in the next several weeks but right now we're going to buy some time um i've already sent over avalanche to or AVAX to my uh, wallet and also sent over here. You can see we're going to do this later, in this, but it's just getting on my nerves now. Some Shiba Inu to this wallet as well. Coinbase took a bunch of way. I, I, I sent like a million one hundred and seventy thousand and it's just only eight hundred fifty one thousand is up there. I was like, dude, y'all are. You know what? Let's go ahead. OK, connect the wallet. So that it will stop bothering me with this. Okay, you good? Let's go over here. Over Avalanche. I'm gonna enter the app. This is um, and remember, go ahead and um, put bookmarks for these things if you don't have them. I don't on this browser, so I am putting all these things in place. Okay. Connect wallet, MetaMask. Next. All right. So now we have to go get some time because when you stake time, you get memo, which is your state. Is what the was what you want. Why can't I move my guy to figure out how to do that? So we're gonna go here to Trader Joe. You see, I already got it set up because I was thinking about it earlier, making sure. I'm going to do one. Point oh two eight nine nine of um AVAX for time swap swap it's okay transmission okay and you remember AVAX go through super quick for the most part, I can't imagine that it would. Oh, it's still going normally. AVAX super fast. Yeah, I'm about to say, I'm, that's the first time I've ever seen something like that. All right, so now we have time. We go back here to um, Wonderland Control F5. We'll kind of reset if you didn't know. Control F5 will reset your screen. And so I'm going to approve. Remember, we have to approve and then Control F5 again so that we can stake. Charging me 12 cents for this. Wait for this transaction to pinned. So I'm gonna have Klima on this on the um, on this organization's account. And one of the uh members of the organization will be in town tomorrow and um we're going to have a bit of fun. It I think it went through, yes, successful. And I'm going to control F5. And that's just change now to stake instead of approve. Yes, stake time. So I'm going to stake the maximum stake time. Yeah, sing it, daddy. I'm excited. Excited for my guys. So I'm going to move Wonderland time over here next to Clima. <clears throat> Okay, now you see, and then F5 again, but also I can add memo here. I'm going to go here to CoinGecko and add, I believe, oh, it didn't let me add. Oh, oh, I want to get this Morpheus Network. Where, where is it selling at? Okay, Uniswap. Okay. Uh... So memo I think it's memory. 
Yeah. Okay. Well. She's not letting me add that to my MetaMask. So let me go back here to Time Wonderland. And here we can add these tokens to your wallet that way. So you can add it there from the site itself. And so now when I go to my assets, I see my snowbank, my stake snowbank, and also can see my memo. Now, somebody gave a good advice that, you know, you know, putting these here to, to look, but also this is, um, and that's good for everyone just to, at home, but for the, you know, daily people. And a lot of times, you know, by the time you, you watching these type of videos, you're pretty far deep in a uh, cryptocurrency, uh, you know, it'll be a time before people were kind of new will get to this unless, you know, somebody who's friendly to you give you this information. But I kind of try to do things in case people are at different levels of understanding. So I, I really try to make it really simple. And I'm still told by my friends that it's very complicated, even though I try to make this as simple as I think is possible. Um, well, as simple as I can make it, I feel not as possible, but as, as, I, as I can make it, it's still very complicated. So, you know, we still have fun with it. Anyway, so we got that staked. And I'm going to show some of the numbers here in a second. Um, so we here we have a 9% rate you see in um, almost 9.5% for the five-day return with a uh, every eight-hour rebase of uh, 0.61. So that's good news. You see here they have a APY of 78,000. So time is doing well and this balance has a runway of over a, a, a year. Time is backed by one mem, one magic internet money. It's it's very complex. We're gonna gonna do a video talking about how time, abracadabra, and popsicle finance feed into each other to where, and this is where the main point of all this is to generate passive income. Passive income that can help you generate generational wealth. And so these loops are created by this guy. He seems to be a financial genius and definitely a programming genius feed into each other. So you buy time, okay, and we staked it, and we take this memo, and we can go to Abracadabra, borrow money against the memo, borrow um, magic internet money meme against, against, this is how I think I understand it so far, but I'm not 100%, so I'm still. So this is a, um, magic internet money is a stable coin. It's supposed to always stay near a dollar, right? And so each time is supposed to be pegged to one mem. So every time a time is created, even though time is now worth uh, $8,000, it'll never go less than a dollar because each one created is, is back to a dollar, but it doesn't have, it's not pegged to a dollar. It's just pegged to one mem. So everyone, you know, each time will never go under one mem because each time, you know, it's, it's always, at least has that in reserve. The reason why it has so much other price is because of the mint. Because you're able to take your mem and stake it and get 8%. Or if you go into a liquidity pool, like we I just showed you on Uniswap, something similar to what we have here. I'm on the wrong network. But you know what I have here with the Ethereum and USD liquidity pool where I say that people are borrowing and, and trade money for me. You can do the same thing with time and AVEX. You can do that with time and mem. And people are then taking those tokens because here when you see I made a, a mm, I'll show you on when we do the the uni um, the sushi swap stuff. Some sorry sushi swap the Shiba swap where you take your receipt that you do have a liquidity pool and you can take that receipt the receipt of it which is these LP tokens. I'm pointing out on the screen. You can't see me pointing, but I'm now kind of highlighting. These LP is a receipt that you have a pool going somewhere else making money. You take the receipt that you got that pool going. I keep saying the word over and over again because I want you to understand that. And you can use that receipt for things. So people are taking their receipts and putting their uh, um, staking a receipt of something else they're doing um, and, um, in this pool. And that has value. So that's why you have where it goes from being pegged to one mem, which is a dollar per each time to being worth 
$8,067. And so that's one thing. So you got time pegged to the mem, but it, you know, it's taking these liquidity um, uh, um, tokens from other people and is giving them time at a cheaper price so that so that's getting money off of that and it's taking that money is making from selling time cheaper for these liquidity um tokens to um giving you and paying that out that's where all that money is coming from in terms of the the apy is being paid from the mint people minting on the website getting cheaper time so they're buying time for cheaper with their stuff then using that money, time pays out. I'm sorry, Wonderland pays out the APY for people who are staking time or slash into memo. All right. So if you can understand that, it's a bit of a loop in and of itself. Then the next level up is you can take your rap memo, which is like a liquidity. It's a receipt of your time, which is like, you know, think of it like a LP token liquidity Tokens, not liquidity though. It's a it's a, a a stake receipt, and you can go borrow money against it on Abracadabra. So you can borrow mem, and then take that mem and go buy more time. And you can kind of go into this cycle over and over in all these different apps and really get your money going crazily. So that's the plan. We're going to show all, all of this. We're going to take some money on Wonderland. We're going to add it over this over time. Hopefully, just go for several years, if not forever. But take money on time. Then you know I'm I'm a little. Because if you take your rap memo and something happened to that, then you out of it. But supposedly all these apps are connected. So if anything, go, everything go. So I'm going to take the rap memo, go to Abracadabra, borrow money, go to Popsicle Finance. And then there, it's almost like one. If, once you can set up in the right pool, and I'm going to show all that, you could, you could set up to where it'll loop your money 10 times. It'll do the same thing, loop. Take it, go switch it, take it, switch it, switch it into all these things and you know, you're borrowing against yourself in some places, but you're getting so much more interest that it pays itself out. So this is the future. This is decentralized finance. This is it's so exciting. So let's get to Shiba Swap. What is Shiba Swap? In a nutshell, we're going to go super quick because we're already at 17 minutes. And I said I didn't want to um, be all extra long with it. So Shiba Swap. Is the if you have Shiba Inu and a lot of people love Shiba Inu, don't just let it just sit there. There's what you, what we're gonna do, and I'm gonna show it super quick. Is we're going to stake our Shiba Inu. We're going to bury Shiba. Is that with the sheep? Yes. So I have this much sheep. I'm going to stake all of it. Approve. Charging me twenty nine dollars in Ethereum to approve. How much Ethereum I got? So I'm doing this before. Okay, I should have enough. All right, so it's approving, and once it's approved, Ethereum goes slower, so I may do other stuff and come back to that. I probably will. Let me explain a little bit of Shiba um, swap to everyone. So this is the difference between Shiba Inu and Dogecoin. Shiba Inu is like is built on Ethereum, but it's going to switch over to its own network, like how we switch, click over here and go to different networks. Shiba is going to have its own here called Shibarium at some point. But right now it's on Ethereum. It's a, it's a Ethereum token. But Shiba <clears throat> has, how do I explain this really quick, dirty fashion? It has all the functions of Ethereum. So it has smart contracts, it has NFTs, and it has the ability to have its own, like Uniswap. It has its own Uniswap, its own open seas in terms of NFTs, uh, its own like Wonderland uh, climb a staking pool approve okay so look here how much we get uh, apr 300 and uh, apy i'm sorry not apr sorry apy we'll talk about differences at some point apy 311 percent on your shiba so if you got shiba and you know you got a million shiba wouldn't you like to have three million no i'm sorry four million next year on your shiba just putting it here as opposed to sitting it in your whatever your coinbase whatever wallet you have bone and we'll talk about bone and leash in a second leash and bone you get 460 apy and uh for leash and for bone 1957 so what are bone and leash inside shiba has its own ecosystem most people don't know any of this they love shiba i'm shiba army i'm shiba shiba they don't even know how his own ecosystem his own website it's like i said nfts its own, um, you can swap tokens back and forth. 
uh, you can prove liquidity. So what is liquidity? Say if we had, well, we have Ethereum and Shiba. So let's go here and see what the, the, the um, I'll show you here. So do they have a Shiba Ethereum one? Okay, so they have a Shib and a and an ETH pool that you can go into. Okay? And that pool will pay you out 67. And this is not um where is that Shib? I'm sorry, Shib and ETH. And this is not the this is a different liquidity pool. This is something else. I'll show you what this is in a second. This pays out um from the from the tokens. Your Shiba Swap liquidity provider tokens SSLP fifty five point ninety nine, a fifty five nine point ninety nine percent. Now, if you got Bone in ETH two hundred fifteen liquidity pool, you run it with that or Leash and Bone. So let's go back here. If you want to provide liquidity, say we're going to um, create a pair. We say okay, I got some ETH. I can put it or and, uh, and I got Shiba. You imagine she would be right there, but you see how it's set up and look identical to Uniswap, and that's all it is. Somebody just, you know, put the uh, a similar um, user interface in. So, okay, I'm just gonna say I'm going to do fifty thousand, fifty thousand, and I could approve this. I'm just gonna see how much they charge. If it's not too bad, um. I'm not going to spend that right now. I'm not going to spend that right now. But if it was like a couple cents, I would have. But $35? Come on. How much we got in here? This wallet? I think I got 175 And I still want to um, put some in a bury some. Anyway. I can provide liquidity. And by providing liquidity, I'll get a, some, a certain number depending on my portion I have of the pool of Shiba and Ethereum, I get a certain number of liquidity provider um, tokens, the SSLP. And then I take those and I go over here to Woof and I approve and, and stake those and get extra money. So it's the same way like I told you on Wonderland Time where, okay, we're staking time and getting money, but now I can take my receipt of my time, which is the memo, somewhere else and stake that as well and get money on that as well that's so Shiba has all of that all of that in one place but right now we're going to go ahead and bury some Shiba oh that's it the gas is only that well look maybe Maybe I will provide a little bit of liquidity real quick. Let's go back and see. If the gas is going to be that, I'll just do that just to kind of show you how this will look. I'll take a little bit out just to, you know. Okay. Everything look aces. So if that makes sense and you understand, is there anything else when it approves or anything I want to talk about? Oh, this is important as well. So we got that, this bookmark, but I go here in analytics. And this will show you all your money that's on the platform, what it's doing. And I go here, uh, somehow I got this on a dark. Oh, sorry, sorry, dark. I go here to portfolio. Wait, what? Cancel. Portfolio. Oh, do I got to put my address in? And then we'll bookmark this page as well, the portfolio page that I thought it was going to take me to. All right. All right. Sometimes it, it, it acts a little bit slow. So let me come back here and see. Wait, I'm about to say, dog, don't. <laughs> I'm about to come back and do all this again. So you see I have such a small share, less than 0.01% of the pool um, by giving this amount. But if it's not too expensive, 
Insufficient fun. Oh no, they're charging. Yeah, you see that? That's a point three. We, we will not be doing that. Okay, so let's reject that. It was a good idea, but we'll come here and bury our sheep. We would bury all the sheep that we have then. Oh, so even that's forty-seven dollars. We we'll skip it. We good. We good. So we're staking sheep now. On this Sheba swap, which should pay out in bone. 310%. Oh, okay. Wait. Tokens. And then Ethereum, 7.64. And Sheeb APY, 0 0.06. APR does not take into account the compound of interest within a specific year. Calculate multiplying the periodic interest rate by the number of periods in a year in which the periodic rate is applied. It does not. Investment companies generally advertise APY to attract because it seems like they earn more and things are sure to advise. Unlike APR, it doesn't does take into account the account of frequency which the interest is applied to effects of entry year compounding. So APR, no compounding, APY compounding. Periodic rate, number of periods in the year, period number of periods. Alright. That's pending. We'll go back. Figure out, okay, okay. So here's our portfolio and I'm gonna go ahead and bookmark that. So when I wanna, we'll look at this as well. We look at our Uniswap, we'll look at our Shiba swap. We will look at our Clima Wonderland Snowbank. So we have things set up now. Okay, total berry, you see now 851,445 Shib. And we'll keep an eye and see what, what that looks like. And so let's look what that looks like on this. We'll come back. Oh, okay. So you see the value of it is $41.65. Oh, it's already went up 54 cents. Hey. Hey, hey. So we can see we deposit, withdrawn, pending. All right. And if we had some other pairs, liquidity pairs, we would see them down here. So. This is something else to keep an eye on. You know how I go. With that, I love you. You love you. God loves us. And that's all that matters.